Hello children today's story is the jungle book It was a quiet day deep in the Indian jungle Bagheera the panther was walking along the river Suddenly the silence was broken by a strange sound Bagheera went to see what was making the noise It was a man cub He found the baby boy in a basket which lay in a half sunken boat. Bagheera felt sorry for the baby. Carefully he carried the basket ashore. The man cub will never survive without a mother. Bagheera said to himself. What should I do with you little fellow? He asked the smiling baby. Bagheera remembered that a wolf family lived nearby. Perhaps they would adopt the man cub. Bagheera brought the basket to the wolf's den. When the mother wolf and her cubs found the laughing baby, they smiled. Rama, the father wolf, was not so pleased at first. But soon He too was smiling at the man cub. The wolves named the man cub Mowgli. For 10 years he lived happily in the jungle. Mowgli learned many things from the wolves. He learned how to run like a wolf. He learned how to scratch himself like a wolf. He even learned how to play dead like a wolf just for fun. But one day there was some bad news in the jungle. Shere Khan the tiger had returned. The fearsome tiger hated all humans because a hunter had once shot at him. Mowgli was now in danger. So late that night the wolf pack gathered with Bagheera on Council Rock. Even the strength of the pack is no match for Shere Khan. declared Akela the pack leader the man cub must leave at once but he is like my own cub protested rama where will he go then bagheera spoke up perhaps i can help i know of a man village where mowgli will be safe i'll take him there It was agreed that Bagheera and Mowgli should leave the next morning. But taking Mowgli to the man village would not be easy. This is my home, protested Mowgli as Bagheera tried to pry him from a tree. I don't want to leave the jungle. Reluctantly, Mowgli began the journey to the man village with Bagheera. Night began to fall. When they came to a big tree Bagheera decided they would spend the night there Go to sleep he told Mowgli as they settled themselves on a large branch But they were not alone Ka the snake was hiding in the tree and he thought Mowgli would make a tasty treat Yes man cub Ka whispered as he slithered down the tree Go to sleep Mowgli woke up and saw Ka Go away leave me alone he said to the snake But Ka just smiled an evil smile and said Do not be afraid man cub trust me Go to sleep Ka stared at Mowgli Mowgli stared back but he began to feel dizzy he was under Ka's spell Ka wrapped his long tail around Mowgli Bagheera woke up just in time what are you doing Ka he shouted Bagheera slapped Ka with his paw before the snake could hurt Mowgli Ka fell to the ground with a thud. You have made a serious mistake, Bagheera, 
said Ka as he slithered off. Back up on the branch, Bagheera said. You see, Mowgli, the jungle is too dangerous for you. You will be safer in the man village. But I want to live in the jungle. I can take care of myself, cried Mowgli. No, said Bagheera kindly. You belong in the man village. We will go there in the morning. I hope you all are enjoying the story, children. We will continue the story in the next video. So please make sure you like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching. Until next time, goodbye.